Hey, how's it going? I'm making a legendary strategy video. I believe this is my 11th one. I think, I'm not entirely sure. I'm calling this Icy Doom. Uh, what you do is you gotta use that uh, ice item you can get in Smash Bros. I have no idea what it's called. You throw it to a guy hanging on the side, and he should be frozen. And then we'll fall to his doom if it's executed perfectly. As you see here, I hit Charizard with it. And the big old hunk of a dragon just plummets to his doom. I actually think Charizard's a lizard, so... Whatever, he's still a fat ass. He actually honestly isn't that fat either, he just, I don't know. So it's like, oh, also sometimes I think what just happened there, you can throw in because they have such high damage. They don't even fall to their doom, they just could rocket up to the sky. It's kind of an interesting way to kill them. And right here, oh boy, everyone's frozen. I only get one knock out of it though. So I gotta be honest with this strategy. Although I did win every single game I played, I don't believe it was because of the strategy. It was probably because I put ice, uh, this ice item on high and the only item available. And also these computers at level 1. I don't believe if you actually play someone online or actually someone of level 2 or greater that they're going to be this stupid and actually die to this over and over again. Like I'm pretty sure all you gotta do is just mash A or something to get out of the uh, ice cycle so there's certainly plenty of time for them to do that and they just don't. I'm not saying it's a bad strategy but it just won't be any effective unless you're against a level 1 and have this ice item on all the time. But hey, you can win a rarity in these strategies. This is still a pretty chill strategy, and I think it's one of the better ones. I think it's one that, if you utilize it to perfection, like right here, I freeze the shit out of Samus, and then she, she falls to her death. If you're a big fan of ice, I'd recommend this strategy. If you're a big fan of winning against people who don't have a chance to defend themselves, I recommend this strategy. If you're a big fan of strategies that probably won't help you in any situation at all in Smash Bros, I'd recommend this strategy. It's a good strategy, I'd really recommend it. That's it. See ya.